Hi to all the various stations we have available here. Students setting aside time to unwind only weeks away from summer break. But it turns out the university had another break in mind, an academic break when it made Towson a test optional school. This is our third year and about 80% of the students that apply, apply as test optional, which means they do not submit a test score to Towson University. And uh, it's great because what it's doing for us is it's providing a bigger net. And another opportunity to enroll students who may not be successful test takers. I think it's a good thing. I feel like it puts a lot of pressure on students to like study hard for the SATs. And some people are just not very good at taking tests, especially standardized tests that, you know, sometimes it's catered towards a certain demographic. It gives a bunch of students options, you know, that aren't necessarily good at standardized testing like myself. Um, it gives us an option to apply, you know, using our credentials that aren't necessarily standardized tests. But the university stressed that the recent change in its admissions policy should not be seen as a lowering of academic standards. The test is just one measure and there's other factors you know that are important for a student's academic success and GPA, what they take in high school, what activities they're involved with, uh, how they write their essay. As the university continues to keep data from this decision, they believe it will show they made the right choice. On the campus of Towson University, Tim Tutin, WBAL, TV 11 News.